Hello and welcome to my fresh start series on Black Desert Online. The idea of this journey is in the sense of an Iron Man. The most important rules to mention are, this account will be 100% free to play, zero dollars will be spent on this account, and all upgrades on this account must be self-enhanced. And if you want to check out the full list of details, you can find them in the description down below. Be sure to subscribe if you want to check out more videos from me, and check out my Twitch live stream where you can see it all happen. Hello and welcome back. As seasons change, the pace in which the winds flow lead us to a familiar place. As I'm starting to work on a ferry for this account in hopes that I can get appropriate tools like auto healing, auto buffing, and increased weight. All three I would say are equally valuable in their own ways. Even getting low grades of these skills would come in handy at this stage into the account. But finally getting lucky and rolling a tier 3, pushing it to tier 4, and seeing how my luck plays out, is the name of the game as high hopes remain for what I am needing. Thankfully I've got some free pay to win materials on the side given through events, and I took advantage of these by taking some stabs at rolling the fairy skills to see if I'd get any luck. Sadly, I kept getting consistently bad outcomes, and I don't know if this was necessarily the decision I should have made. And at this point, all ferried out, I'm not really pleased with this result, but the extra weight will help for the time being. And in the background, I'm continuing my Pit of Undying daily quest in order to keep up with loot scrolls. Any event maids that I'm getting, I'm putting towards storage maids so I can manage more trash loot at further distant spots. And the barrier of infestation is a slow process, but continuing to get done in the background as everything is starting to come together. This account is actually unfolding quite nicely. And fresh into some new recent seasons, I'm trying to get my characters done for that extra needed loot. Inventory slots, pets, maids, loot scrolls, all of these things still hold tremendous value for this account, so it'd be foolish for me to steer away from doing this. And I won't lie, with playing two accounts, running seasons back to back to back to back starts to get pretty old pretty quickly, but I eventually do find myself at the finish line for this task. And with Hungry for more brackets, I felt it was finally time to take this Tet Black Star that I enhanced and change it into a God Array weapon and see if I can squeak myself closer to higher AP brackets and more silver earning potential. Now, the God Array is definitely a stack trap in my opinion, but also from this perspective of a new player account, this almost feels like the Ofen Tet of Black Stars, an item that can allow you to push simple brackets closer to smaller brackets but where duo is typically where other players would stop, I think that on this account, I'm going to attempt to push mine to pen and utilize cron stones from events to hopefully allow me to get lucky with some easy clicks. But only time will tell.
So turning in my Barrier of Infestation quest, I've claimed another DP from a journal and landed myself into the 273 bracket with great potential from this point forward. And it's only up from here now, my ooks.